Sicilian journalist Maria Grazia Cutuli was killed while reporting in Afghanistan. Her memory lives on in Herat province, in the shape of a school for the village of Koshrud. The project was commissioned by Maria's brother, Mario Cutuli, an architect based in Rome. Questa scuola si è deciso di farla in Afghanistan perché l'Afghanistan è il paese che Maria Grazia conosceva molto, era il paese che Maria Grazia amava, ma era anche il paese dove purtroppo Maria Grazia è morta. Eh, la scuola quindi prende origine proprio dal ricordo di Maria Grazia, ma anche da quelli che erano i suoi racconti. The layout of the school is inspired by the surrounding villages. Enclosed by an outer wall, the classrooms and other buildings are clustered together as if without conscious planning. Outdoor areas are interspersed among the eight classrooms, creating spaces for the children to play. The exteriors were painted in three shades of blue, a reference to the local lapis lazuli pottery. We decide to use one color to represent it, to give a characteristic to give also to the people that live in the area, to link the architecture to something that they can use as a symbol. We choose the blue because it's an important color in the tradition of uh, Afghanistan, from the lapis lazuli, and they use the blue color for decoration inside the mosque or other important building. The double height library is the only building visible from outside the outer wall. The library is intended for use by the entire village, part of an effort to win local support for the school. We decided to make the library a little bit higher than the other uh, volumes to point out the importance of culture and the importance of books, the tradition of books in Afghanistan. But the fact is that after the uh, Taliban, after two, three years of war, the library is still empty. We are very not happy for that, but it stands as a challenge for the school itself to try to fill again this empty library with the books.